You're lucky, you little fried pancake. There we go, another Titan Slayer. We are cleaning up. Muramit. Boom, Titan Slayer. Ladies and gentlemen, I give you the projectile Bolivar Sharanga, the ultimate projectile build in the game. We have four onslaught reactors, four of them. 500 meter range, 10 second reload. Remember, double shots per one clip, if that makes sense. Four onslaught reactors. We could do a quantum sensor, but we only get a 350 meter range with the quantum sensor, and we're probably gonna be sitting at like that 400 meter mark. So I thought, screw it, four onslaught reactors. This is more firepower than even the behemoth thermite. It is ridiculous. We're going to war, let's nuke. Okay, Dreadnought City. All right, here we go, here we go. We gotta charge up our Sharanga first, of course, but I'm extremely excited. I can't remember the last time I, or if I ever used this Sharanga build. Also guys, consider subscribing if you have not already, if you wanna see robots get nuked. And remember, we used the projectile movements last week, and this Sharanga is gonna be like twice as crazy as that one. Oh geez, there's chaos. Chaos, chaos, chaos. Okay, we're gonna dip out of there. We got a little bit of damage going, but I wanna charge up my Titan. Of course, that's what this, this game is. What's this guy? Did Aujun? Okay, you know what? I think we can go after this guy. Three, two, our ability's almost back. All right, we're going after. We have the whiteout drone to EMP him. EMP, EMP, there we go. We EMP'd him. Oh, jeez, why does it... Oh, oh, man. Oh, we gotta teleport back. Ah, uh, we could have stayed and maybe fired some more shots, but I think it was good that we teleported back. We played it more safe. We played it safe. All right. I'm just keeping my eye on the Titan bar. Now it's at, what, a quarter charged up? Okay, let's, um, I'm going after the Aujun. I'm coming to kill you. I'm gonna rip your nose off and feed you ice cream. There we go, kill, kill, kill. Okay, let's see if we can get a double. This Typhon, he's got his Razda. I see a lot of Typhons these days in Champion League. Oh, come on. Double kill, but he's got reinforcements. It was not good, not good, not good. Okay, we're gonna need to drop another robot. Um, what should we drop in here? Yeah, you know what, let's go Behemoth, our Behemoth Puncher. Surely that should be able to take down these super durable revenants. Ah, get away from me. This guy's harassing me. Okay, wait, we're using our North Light. The stupid drone shields! And if you guys ever thought the Behemoth Thermite build was crazy, I gotta calculate how much damage it really is per shot with four Onslaught Reactors. But four Onslaught Reactors plus the Sharanga full power is absurd, plus boosters. That is the craziest projectile damage you'll ever see in the game. Okay, North Lighting. This Kepri's coming at us. This Kepri's coming at us. Boom, kill! See you later, Kepri. Nerd, nerd. It feels so good to kill Kepri's because they're all over Champion League. And they're pretty annoying. Pretty annoying. Okay, wearing that guy's health down. We're down to 120 HP on this thing. Oh god, is this guy gonna kill us? This guy might kill us. This guy might kill us. Oh, I just wasted my North Light applesauce. Okay, we're dropping in our Sharanga, though. All right, let's get some kills, man. Let's get some kills. These weapons look pretty, look pretty freaking awesome. All right, here we go, 500 meter range. Boom, we just dumped two nukes, projectile nukes on that luchador. So obviously hitting Titans is the best for these weapons because the targets are so big. Oh, for that second shot he put on his reflector. Those are two Titans we can hit. Wait for it, come on, wait for it. All right, he's going up. Fire away. Bingo, Titan Slayer. We just spanked that luchador. We sent him to hell. Maybe not, he might have more robots. He might be coming, he might be reincarnating as another robot. Okay, that damage is pretty good too. Oh, all right, my teammate took him out. Looks like they're dropping into all their Titans right now. Now they have 
double luchadors down there. If they can come a bit more into center. Just like that. There we go. Remember, with all the modules and a max luchador, you can get like 1.4 million HP. So the fact that we just... Look at this. Holy man. The fact that we just got him to like half health means we're probably dealing around 700,000 per clip. There we go. This is so satisfying to do. This absolutely launched these boulevards. Somebody recommended this build the other day in the Discord too. Shout out to whoever did that. I forget the name. Come on, wait for it. Ah. And I know you could try to take down or try to target Muramits with this build. But I figured that it's just better to run all Onslaught Reactors. Because then you can still keep your 500 meter range distance and deal more damage. Oh, double titans. Alright, here we go. That is a Gargantua Sharanga. Holy man. <laughs> He's now looking up being like, who just landed that shot? Who just landed? Here we go, two more. Oh, the second one hit a Aegis Shield. That second one might have ended him. You're lucky, you little fried pancake. There we go, another Titan Slayer. We are cleaning up. What do we have, three? Two or three Titan Slayers. And remember, there's only six enemy Titans in total. That's the most Titans that a team can drop in, right? Because six, six. So the fact that we've killed, what, two, almost three? Pretty impressive. Okay, not sure what's... See, the problem is, this is obviously the downside of these weapons. Is hitting... There we go. Hitting these faster normal robots, like a Kepri, is extremely difficult. Unless you catch them not moving, or somebody locks them down. Oh, this guy's coming straight at us. You know what? We might have to ditch this. We might have used up all of our luck. See, alright, let's ditch this Sharanga. Let's try to take down this Kepri. Uh, he's pretty much in our spawn right now. So let's go uh, Kitsune Harpy. We do have a pretty good beacon bar lead. They're attacking our home beacon though. We're going to have to try another game because I want to nuke more titans. This might be my favorite build of all time. I don't know about all, all time, but definitely one of the best Charanga builds for sure. Come on. You're almost dead. You're almost dead. That was the worst accent ever. Man, these... Oh, these freaking Capris. Okay, he's almost dead now. Somebody kill him. Alright, I'll kill him. Kill! There we go. Alright. Alrighty. Okay, they're mecking out pretty hard here. We're getting four cap and it might be time to wrap this up. We got four beacons and their beacon bar is draining. It's draining like an orange lemonade. That doesn't make any sense. This behemoth's camping. Alright, we're just gonna... Alright, so there's game one. Two to three? I think it was two Titan Slayers, but we got a lot of shots actually landed. You're not gonna really one-hit Titans, but we did have pretty much two hits. That was pretty insane. What's our damage? 6.4 million, and most of that damage was with the Bulova. Let's go game two. Third on the scoreboard, I think. Yeah, there we go. Alright, let's go game two. Sharanga Nuke. Alright. Dead City. This was kind of the map I was hoping for. Because it's a brawling map. But then it also has tall cover buildings. Which are good for a Sharanga to kind of hide behind, right? Because we are kind of hiding behind it. We don't want to go 1v1 with a Titan and he's 100 meters in front of us. That is bad news, bear. Alright, let's cap this beacon. Ooh, that is a... You know what? Now that we're already in our Scorpion here, let's try to... Screw off, stupid Hiroshi. Let's try to take down these camping harpies. Uh-oh, this guy's in trouble. Uh-oh. Dead kill. See you later. To push, everyone's going to center. Everyone is going to center. This Capri's almost dead. He's got a weird build. Double kill. There we go. There we go. And... Okay, somebody killed him. Can we grab center? We're taking heat. We're taking damage! Those stupid camping harpies. 
die. Suck on that one, triple kill. Not so good, huh? Not so good, you camping harpy. When we're 20 meters in front of you. Yeah. The Whiteout Drone EMP is such last for such a short duration that it's not really a make or break of whether you're going to get a kill or not if you can EMP enemy, enemies. It's not like a blackout or something. What's going on here? What the? What the hell was that? That was stupid. We dropped it on the beacon, but then we didn't actually have the beacon. That was dumb. Okay, our Titan's almost charged up. A little bit more. Let's try to clear these guys out, though. They're freaking trying to take our beacon here. Oh my gosh, they're dropping in reinforcements too. Okay, I might need help here, teammates. I might need some help here, teammates. Please. Okay, that harpy's dead. I don't know if I killed him or someone else. This guy's... Alright, he's dead. Why are we not changing this beacon? Bro! Oh, it's a nightingale! Oh, crap balls! We're gonna die. Freaking nuts! Okay, um, I don't, our Titan's not even charged yet. So, that's fantastic. We gotta clear these guys off the beacon! Let's go, teammates! Yeah, see, the Nightingale, if the Nightingale takes off while he's on our beacon, then they can hold it in the air. That's how he's holding it right now. He's in the sky, but he took off from the ground that was in our beacon. That's how he's holding it. What a nerd. What a nerd. Oh, now I can't hit him. Okay, somebody killed him, I think. Oh. Whoa, I didn't realize we're at 50,000 HP and we're losing. We've lost to Havoc. We're going to shield up here. Cap the beacon. And now we're out. See you later. All right, now we're switching. Almost, almost. And there we go. All right. Sharanga time. We actually might have dropped it. Uh, I guess there's a Titan there. Remember, I want to target the enemy Titans especially. Even though the onslaught damage reactors. Boom, there's a kill. Even though the onslaught reactors obviously affects robots and Titans. The Titans are the juicy targets. This guy's stuck. Oh my. Jeez. That was straight up half that luchador's health. Because he's stuck in that weird spot. Full power. Oh, actually, no. Never mind. He had his reflector up there, but he's going to drop down. There's a mirror mitts there, too. All right, let's reload. Reload. There we go. Oh, he's almost dead. He's got one weapon left right now. Somebody might kill him. All right, Minos is going to steal my kill, but it's all right. Mirror mitts. Boom! Titan Slayer! Man, it's so exciting and nerve-wracking when you're aiming at a Titan. Everything is posi in position, but you're waiting for the reload on your weapons. It's very nerve-wracking because you're like, oh, is this guy going to take off? Is he going to jump at me? Is someone else going to kill him? Uh, hold on. Especially because the reload's 10 seconds, so you want to make every shot count. Hitting those darn Kepris. When, when's the Kepri nerf going to happen? Is that going to happen anytime soon, or am I, hope, am I hoping that it's going to happen it's never going to happen? I'm so lucky lucky. That's what that guy's name is. Very interesting. Very interesting. That's a Fenro, a bit of a slower target. Bro, I just fired both shots into his stupid drone shielding. Shielding absolutely kills projectile weapons. Because if you have one HP on an Aegis shield... It will block a whole firing shot of a projectile. Man, they capped this beacon again? Jeez, okay, hold on. Ah, the first shot landed, second shot hit the stupid drone shielding again. Oh, there's a luchador. That is a luchador there. Wait, he's got his reflector, I can tell. Oh, Okay, I guess we should fire. That one takes down the Aegis. Yeah, that one didn't land as clean as I would like. You know what? Actually, I gotta pay attention to the beacon bar here. We're down on the beacon bar. I'm so lucky, lucky. What's he running? Oh, he's running a Capri. 
See, we barely hit those robots. If we can land the shots, it does a ton of damage. But if you can't land the shots, it's worthless. This guy's coming at us. We do have our north light. There we go. Those shots definitely landed. He's going to try to push our beacon. We're reloading. See, this is what I'm talking about. We're reloading. And it's... Okay, okay. He's now copying the beacon. Oh, we're getting boosted by a Kepri right now. We're getting super boost from a Kepri, and that's why we are running so fast. Now that Luchador has his reflector up. Gosh. Okay, wait for it. Oh my gosh. Luchador, the reflector, the, the frog splash, the north light shielding. So annoying. Okay. Wait for it. Wait for it. Yes, finally. Loser. Titan Slayer. We took out that ice cream tr truck falafel chicken. Man, we're still in this build in this 2 minutes, 40 seconds left to go in the game. Dude, this is getting dicey, man. We are... We might be 5 capping them right now. Ow. Oh, we did land on that Kepri, but... We didn't take him out. Now we're getting suppressed. Remember, we do not have any Titan anti-control modules for this. We're going all Onslaught Reactors, which I don't recommend. But we're stupid, so we're doing it. Ooh, what's, what's that guy in? Zephyr? Oh, we would have taken him out, but the drone shielding saved him in that second shot. Oh, yikes, yikes, yikes. Oh, he's out of range. We can't phase shift him. Or whatever, red phase shift him. All right, we gotta win this game though. We got a four cap, but it's still close. We have a four cap, but it is still close. They might need like a three or four cap right now at this rate. It seems like my team's kind of pushing forward here though. See, I, that, I find that so weird that I'm so kill, that I'm so lucky lucky guy just dropped in his Titan with a minute 40 left in the game. That's usually not a great idea unless you're doing so well with your other robots and capping a lot of beacons. All right, there we go. Boom, we got the win. That was two solid games of nuking Titans. That Sharanga build is so awesome. The Sharanga is an absolute firepower monster. Monster House. Monster House, great movie. 5.5 million damage leading our team. Three beacons got the win. All right, guys, until next time, peace. SpaghettiO, chicken McNuggets. Make sure to subscribe.